coming up in this video, I'm going to show you a clone I found, a bad boy Carolina Herrera. I was shopping around in the Ulta store for a nice fragrance to travel with. Summertime in New York could be 60 to 80 degrees. Got some Platinum Invictus, some Chanel Allure. Towards the middle of the video, I'm going to show you what I did in New York, and I found a whole bunch of hidden gem clones. I'm going to add that to this video. This is going to be fantastic. We're going to start today with my favorite. It's called Bad Boy Extreme. Now you're thinking, that's not a summery fragrance, but it's a fragrance that gets a lot of compliments. If you want, I guarantee you, you'll get compliments with this. I'm talking about Risen Up on some 40s with the shorty. Fellas, this has incense Opapa Nox resins, which makes the fragrance last even longer. It's probably the longest lasting fragrance on the entire list of the fragrances I'm gonna talk about today. And then it has some delicious sweet notes, the cacao note, Indian ginger. Next, you have this fragrance. It's called Coach Open Road. The prices on this vary. The prices on this vary as well. The Carolina Herrera, I've seen them for $60 to $70. 1.7, maybe $100 for the big ones. And then this is a five ounce bottle. It's your best bang for your buck because you want to spray away. Open Road, this is a unique fragrance. Lasts about five to six hours. It's made by Coach. It's got some sort of green notes in it. Vetiver, lavender, lemon, and red apple. Very Cartier elegant like. Very pleasant and even enthusiasts are loving it. What does enthusiast mean? It means those level two niche, they don't go off on this where they might go off on some other coach. The other fragrance that uses red apple that I really like, costs a little money, it's called Born in Roma Coral Fantasy by Valentino. Another fragrance that'll get you mega compliments. It costs a little money. I'm not gonna show you the clone of it because I haven't found it yet. I just wanted to show you about the fragrance. It smells so good and likable. So you could wear this to a dinner. You could wear this to an audition. You can wear this to an interview. You can wear it on a plane. And this is very important because you don't want to smell like body odor on a plane. You want to have some smell. And it's a perfect plane fragrance. The next fragrance has been like for summertime. People debate. Well, should I get Percival? Percival is a fragrance that costs three, four hundred dollars by Parfums of Marley, and it's very good. Ultimately, it smells like Amber Combrey and Fitch Fierce in the beginning five minutes. Another fragrance that people com compliment in their brain, they, they say, should I buy Aqua di Gio Profondo, which is an aquatic version of the famous Giorgio Armani. It has sea notes in it. It's got some mastic resins in it. It's got some green notes in it. It's got cypress in it. It lasts on my skin seven hours. Some people say 10, some people say five. Some people tell you go buy Chrome Extreme. It's $50, which is half the price of this. And that's a true statement. You can do that. Or you can buy this for $20. It's called RMAF Trainee Nui Lyric. It doesn't last like seven hours, but it definitely lasts four to six hours, depending on how much you spray. It has the exact same notes as that Aqua de Gio Profondo. And when I spray this, I absolutely love the lavender note that comes out along with the musk and the bergamot. It smells very natural. Now, do not get confused. This is called RMAF Trainee Nui Lyric. I call it Lyric Red because it's a red bottle. They do make a fragrance called Armaf Tre Nui, which can, if you're brand new to fragrances, I don't recommend that. It smells like Creed Green Irish Tweed, but that fragrance can gag you. Maybe you're not used to Creed Green Irish Tweed style fragrances yet. So if you're brand new, this is absolutely the perfect fragrance for a beginner for has 20 to $25 budget. I would recommend you get this and the longevity isn't bad. The next fragrance to get is called John Barbados Artisan Pure. Basically, it's a sophisticated citrusy musk fragrance that just does well in extreme hot weather, like tropical weather. Another fragrance that does well in extreme hot weather, tropical weather, of course, is the Aqua de Gio Profondo. But another one is this Invictus Platinum. 
This does very good and lasts very, a very long time. Invictus Platinum is more rich, more invigorating, and more green, completely different than regular Invictus. I recommend you get this if you have the budget for it. And this smells spot on to guess what? Parfumus de Marley Leighton. What a beautiful, heavy bottle. The cap weighs almost a pound. The bottle, look at the juice. Longevity, eight to 10 hours. As you move along, I found some hidden gems that are just crazy good, like this one. It's called Bawa. This came in this beautiful presentation box. This has a beautiful vanilla note, and it smells 99% spot on to Faco Rabanne Phantom on a budget. It's like $30, that's six hours. Here's one, if you like the smell of Blutus Chanel with a dab of Dior Sauvage, get this, Palacio by La Gazelle. Look at that bottle, it's a nice blue fragrance. Oh my God, delicious fragrance. The next one I found, for you oud lovers, you want something that lasts all day long? This costs $30, I found it online. The website will be linked down below. It's called Amber Oud. It smells like Lancome's Oud Bouquet. Look at how dark it is. It even has real oud inside here. Oud Al Sacra, it's got a beautiful metal eagle on it. It does have the same notes as Oud for Greatness. Very light, mass appealing, easy to wear oud. The next one's called Oud Al Sacra. Atar and this one look at the beautiful juice in the box to this one looks like this Guess what this smells like $434 ombre nomad. Oh my god, you can't beat it It's been on my skin for seven hours. I know I'm just showing you look at all these free fragrances I found here's a new one Uda Sakura. So you got all three you got the one that smells like ombre nomad Louis Vuitton You got the white one which smells like oud for greatness and you got the light colored one which comes in a blue box. Why? This is the box it comes in because it smells like Tom Ford Oud Mineral, which has blue sea notes and minerals and everything. And it lasts just as long. Tom Ford Oud Mineral bottled like this. You have to do the research to find it. This is called Avant Garde. Smells like Prada Loam by Reefs. Look at the juice bubbles. The next one's called Wonder of You. Do you like them pull your money stronger with you? Get this. Here's a bonus for you. This is called Blue Absolute. Spot on, 99.95% spot on. Eau de Toilette Sauvage. You're still there watching me? I want, I want you to see this. This is Eau de Parfum, the one, but it's called Puerto Quino Noir by Reefs. Dolce Gabbana, Eau de Parfum, the one. Let's just say four more fragrances I have to show you before I leave. Carbon Noir, Smells Like Bad Boy by Carolina Herrera. If you like this video, you're gonna love this video right here. Click on it right now and you'll see all of these fragrances in a nice, neat way.